Hello and welcome to my NCVCV, it's number 20. I have been restarting the Creative 444 this week. A bit early, but I'm not... Um, it doesn't seem like I'm having much time next week, so <laughs> I restarted it. This is the first OOC room, never mind the whole, it's just because I want to get in and out. Uh, as I hope I have told you we are going to have a flashback alternative. The first alternative is, of course, uh, play the prequel and then return back in here, as it says in the book. The book? Alright, need to take that one down. Alternative 2, crap the story, who wants it? Or alternative 3, have a short flashback of number 1 and then go on. And it has to be in daylight. And here are some major stuff from the first one. And you're also able to flip lever A if you want to. And then you can see what lever A did in the original from the outside. Because you couldn't see it from the outside in the prequel at all. And then you just continue to the next part. Uh, it's not far, hopefully. And here you get one of these these things that uh, you had some sort of connection between your parents and well, yourself. Um, I did it. Uh, we did all this in vanilla, so I had to do some sort of dialogue. Well, not dialogue, but almost. And then there was talk about a treasure. It, it happens down there. And all along, we are, I'm going to put up signs. Now I have a bit of a problem. Should I give um, the flashback guy some more info, or should I give them less? I haven't really figured that one out. And then the last part, only four parts, because it's going to be short. And that is the train with the option of pulling lever B. It is ready, so if I pull that one, it will go totally <laughs> to pieces. So no fiddling about that. And you did have the options of uh, um, going in to that carriage and talk to your parents, or ignore them and just get out of there. And on your way, oh, those doors shouldn't be open. On your way, you should uh, have the option of pulling lever A or pu uh, pu pulling lever B or not. And there's the problem. Well, let's see. Oh, I haven't <laughs> made any way out. Well, that's simple. Let's do that. And um, well, and then you get um, my my problem with this is when you pull lever. I want a value set. I want to have a value set so later when we are getting back into Chicago you can see the complex. It's not that big. It's about what I thought. Here's CPM's uh, um, uh, spawning point. And when you fall down there you go straight into that uh, first OOC room. But then, when we are getting over here, and inside here we are going to have one of the options of um, the lever B. Now, the parents will be dead anyway, so it's really no, no big deal if they, they pull the lever B or not. But if, if the player pulls the lever B, he, she k kills his own parents. If he doesn't uh, pull the lever B, well, that's ugly. Sorry. Darn. Well, we need to have it, so. Okay, well. Uh, if he doesn't pull, he, she doesn't pull the lever B, then the parents will be killed in a car accident and that's the two different types but in the first case the player kills his own parents he is also 
uh, suspected by the police. Still, yes. Um, and then we start inside this office. Um, this is the next part of the, the flashback or whatever. And inside here, probably on the other side, can't remember. Oh, yeah, there it is. In here, you get the information to keep on now that you have the background you know what has happened and you know how curious were and is still and then you get the facts that you're out of money you have nowhere to live and all that um, and that of course will uh, make it well it's all about revenge it's all about getting back on those who stole your money and all that. Now this is the family solicitor, so he's totally innocent. He has done nothing, he has tried all what he could, and he also suspects Curious, of course. But um, now we'll see about that. Now the problem is, how do I learn about these lever, lever B? And sort of lever A as well, but lever A is not a problem because, well, it was a fire in the <coughs> chimney and yeah, things went bad, yeah. Um, how do I fix this value? And um, I have no idea. Back in the old days you could just go and watch a tutorial. I have been through tutorials for more than two hours and no one gives me the op uh, options that I know uh, want. The new things that started back in uh, 1.6, yeah they talk about it, yes absolutely they are discussing it and debating it and, and so on, but they are doing it in a way that I don't really understand because they are talking gibberish. That's the only <laughs> thing I can say. They are talking totally gibberish. Uh, even Seth Bling doesn't really um, explain anything. Strangely enough, and uh, I mean he's he's one of the good guys, so he should be able. Oh, those doors as well. Well, that doesn't really matter. Uh, and worst of all, I mean I'm, I'm I can't I can't really rely on on people pulling up and, and teaching me what to do or not to do. Of course not. But not even the Wikipedia gives you anything. There is a new tutorial about the, all the, the stuff. But it's talking gibberish as well. It really doesn't give you any help. I don't understand what they're talking about because they are relating to things that you should know and I don't. So, well, it's a bit of a problem. And f thankfully, there is one British guy who have um, well, he had said that he would help me, but um, no. Well, we'll see. He has just started. Whoopsie, um, uh, a, a series about well, commands actually. So hopefully, he will help me. Oh, what did I say? Please take and read the book. No, you should have those one on the same line. Um, yeah, that's better. So we'll see what that will give me. Now I have. Um, if it has to do with scoreboard, it's not that I am totally uh, ignorant in this case. I, I have realized that the the I think at least the dummy um, value and the scoreboard, in some sense, will help me do what I want. Um, it's it's like in the old basic days when you are talking about variables, and if I do it once, I will probably do it more. <laughs> most likely um, and it all has to do with 
if your parents had died in a car accident or you have murdered them, there is a bit of a difference in the story from the beginning. And that's what Curious 2 is all about, having different types of, of innings. How do you get in? How do you do that? A and B. But not more, because if you are going too many different types of, of choosing, then you will go too far from the main story, and that's not what I want. Well, not in this case. Uh, it's not a do-it-yourself, <laughs> choose your own adventure. It's not. What the heck is this? Oh, okay. Well, that's something that might happen. I ruined the gravel. Hmm. Well, how well does that s is seen from up above? Pretty well. Pretty well. Need to fix that. Well, that'll give me something to do while I'm here. Um, well, that's more or less it. Uh, next week, perhaps I'll only work with this like three hours. I don't know, two or three hours. I got a very uh, big week coming up because I'm quitting my vacation. It's my last day of vacation today, Sunday. And um, so I probably don't. I, I, I I don't have that much time to fix things uh, as such. Oh, okay, just so I can't see the redstone torch. <laughs> I wonder what those were there for. Yeah, um, well that's what's going on in the CVCV. Um, uh, nothing much using um, MC edit put up some walls just because I want to keep the the your your uh, view keep your eyes inside the view I want you to see and then there will be a lot of signs I, I don't feel like you should have books in this case because you are going to read and look read and look um, I'm not pulling up the whole story that would be too much but the main ingredients you are coming uh, 12 years old 13 years old sorry and you're going up the lane to your real parents house for the first time and you are angry <laughs> um, I will however um, talk about the creaking boots and the creaking leather jacket that you have stolen on your way to this place yes you have stolen them that's why they are new um, you are not a good person <laughs> and then we'll keep on we'll see what this is going to give me I have a problem with it. it's far from Chicago but it should be within reach if I'm doing the valuables correctly so I hope it's gonna be work out fine right that's an update on the um, oh I can't even remember what it is the vaguely creative vlog anyway the new curious vaguely creative vlog the NCVCV no B version of this this time Okay, thanks for watching and goodbye.